I'm going to talk a little bit about organic foods today. <clears throat> I'm just learning a little bit more about this myself. So I just want to educate you and let you, you know, explain what, you know, some of my experiences so far. You know, this is the first time that I ever bought, like, eggs different than the regular eggs, okay? These are regular eggs. I've been buying these eggs since, I mean, since I was a little kid, just regular eggs, all right? I never knew that there's different type of eggs available to buy until I started to educate myself on like organic and fresh foods. All right, the other day I I purchased these types of eggs. It's called fresh eggs. All right, and you say see right there, the cage free. All right, it says um American Humane Association. Um the the chickens are fed only natural roasted grain. No drugs or antibiotics used. Alright, if you look inside, it reads, <clears throat> you are what you eat. What's true for people is also true for chickens. Over f 40 years ago, Phil Wubena discovered that uncaged, naturally fed chickens were healthier, happier, and created better tasting eggs. Today, his son Rod continues the egg legacy at the 100% cage-free family farm in Forest in Illinois. People like to know the source of their food, so do, so do we eat at fe Phil's. That's why we grow and roast our own corn, soybeans, and other grains to feed the chickens. And we use only rich, high-quality natural ingredients like alfalfa and kelp, no drugs or antibiotics. The simply better feeding methods make the simply better taste. Discover the distance or difference. Phil's fresh eggs makes in all, our, all your cooking and baking. All right. So this is the first time that I tried these eggs, alright? They're gonna be ex more expensive than the regular eggs. They might be, I think I bought them for maybe like three, th th $3.20 for a dozen. Where normally when you get these regular dozen eggs, they might cost like sometimes a dollar, dollar twenty for a dozen. So it, you know these fresh eggs might cost a little bit more than double the price okay so we tried it me and my wife we, we cooked one of these regular eggs cooked one of these um fresh eggs and the eggs the fresh eggs are amazingly different amazingly more tasty um it's hard to explain you have to try it yourself and the eggs are so much higher quality um the regular eggs are more rubbery all right um, the yolk is just really hard, and the, also the egg. My my wife said that the the regular egg right here, the shell is very hard, okay, very hard, um, and brittle. Whereas these cage free eggs, it's more soft. She said, okay, and when when you actually make the eggs, they're they're so much more soft, light in texture. Um, the taste is so much better, and I can't explain it. You got, you just have to try it yourself. Um, I, I could totally tell the difference of the way the egg tastes. After you eat these fresh eggs, or at least after we ate the fresh eggs, we can't even, want, we don't even want to eat the regular eggs anymore because they just, they just don't taste good at all. So that's our experience with the eggs. Okay, um, fresh eggs. Just tastes so much better. All right, now here's some organic oranges. All right, um, I just started buying organic oranges to try it out, and what I noticed is that they taste a lot better than the regular oranges. I mean, it's so much better. The regular oranges, um, they're very, there's no, it's very dry and chewy. You you rarely ever get a regular orange that's juicy. All right, these organic oranges, maybe like 80% of the oranges that are organic that I've tried are extremely juicy. Like, so juicy to the point when you peel the orange, that juice starts, like, coming, you know, flying out, you know, dripping. Whereas the other regular oranges, they're, they're like, they're basically so dry that there's, it's nothing. I mean... It's like eating nothing almost. 
these these oranges I noticed so much significant difference I mean yes like 20% of the time the organic ones are, are kind of dry as well but 80% of the time the oranges are so much higher quality and the nice thing about it is that I bought these oranges for $1.25 a pound the regular oranges kind of run around a dollar a pound so it's only 25 cents more per pound and I really think it's worth it because the quality is so much better in my opinion and my wife agrees as well um, so organic oranges are so much better that's what we've experienced all right here this is the first time I bought this um, strawberry preserve to make like peanut butter jelly sandwiches this is organic and also organic peanut butter the first time that I tried it all right so these are more expensive all right this is regular peanut butter um, but they are more expensive but it tastes so much better like these this organic peanut butter for example is so much more creamy like you could just put it on the knife and then put it on the bread and then it won't break the bread apart because it, it rubs you know it goes on very smooth it's very creamy it's light and when you eat it it's not very that sweet whereas these regular peanut butters are so full of sugar and it's very clumpy. I mean, you try to put it on the bread and it's, it takes effort to put it on the bread and then it tears up the bread. And when I eat this peanut butter, it hurts my teeth sometimes because it's just so much sugar. But with this peanut butter, it doesn't hurt my teeth at all. It tastes very good. And same thing with the strawberry preserve. It's, it's very light in texture and, and when you put it on the bread, it spreads very evenly it doesn't break up the bread it doesn't go in clumps and it's not that um, it's not like all sugary uh, it, it seems like it's more natural f sugar from the from the um, the strawberries that you, they use whereas um, the, the regular jelly has like full of um, you know you know simple sugars and the regular jelly is very clumpy you try to put it onto the peanut butter the bread and then I mean onto the bread and then it's, it's very clumpy you can't even spread it evenly around the bread and once again it's just too too sugary so I noticed that these organic peanut butter in the star preserve is so much better than that the regular peanut butter and the regular jelly it costs more you know sometimes you can find this regular peanut butter for maybe a dollar maybe it, you know, a two dollars for one, or maybe a dollar fifty. But these, um, this peanut butter, organic peanut butter, it runs like almost five dollars. And same thing with this, it runs like almost five dollars. All right, so it's gonna cost more. It costs maybe trip, almost triple the price. But you know, for me, I think I'd rather spend that extra money for some high quality stuff. And in my experience, it's so much better than um, the regular peanut butter and then the regular jelly. I just stated one of the healthiest breads to eat is 100% whole wheat. All right, from my experiences, from all the different breads that I've tried, I think this is one of the best brands out there. It's like really soft, chewy, and it's just a really so much high quality bread that I like. Um, it's called Pepperidge Farm whole grain, 100% um, whole wheat. In my opinion, this is one of the best breads out there. If you try it, compared to the other breads that you eat, you'll, you know, you'll see a difference.